Well, hello everyone and welcome back. Today I discovered something in my garden. And yes indeed, in this bird's house. And as you can see, there are no birds, but a hive of the wild-tailed bumblebee. The scientific name also called Bombus leucorum. This species is common and native throughout Europe. They can appear in a wide range of habitats, ranging from coastal, also grasslands, heathlands and farmlands, and also in towns, gardens and upland, even on woodland edges. Bombus leucorum are one of the first bumblebee species to emerge from hibernation. The queen already emerges in February and they usually can be found flying above the ground, looking for holes that are suitable for their new nest. In this case it was my bird's house! But I leave them hanging there, because most bumblebee species are not a threat to humans. We are even benefiting from these master pollinators and they will only attack when they need to defend their nests. Speaking of defending their nests, if you think that the bird is the biggest natural enemy of the bee, think again. And we don't even talk about pesticides yet. The biggest threats for the beehives are the European hornets. The European hornets are real serial killers and they can destroy a whole beehive. This in a couple of weeks. The white-tailed bumblebee colony can have as many as 400 workers. And the males will start to emerge later, around August. As in many other bumblebee species, the males will fly in a low patrolling circuit. Well, this was a little video about the wild-tailed bumblebee. I also made a video about Bombus terrestris, which I will link on the end of the video and in the description below. So, I thank you all for watching, don't forget to like and subscribe and I see you next time. Bye bye wingers!